a ketogenic diet was specifically designed to be a very rapid weight loss tool. And that means that when you eat a ketogenic diet and you eat less than 30 grams of net carbs per day, it can dramatically improve your ability to lose weight. Nobody's gonna disagree with the fact that a ketogenic diet can actually help you lose a lot of weight. As a result of losing a lot of weight, your blood pressure can also go down. Your A1C can also go down. Your fasting blood glucose can go down. Your post-meal blood glucose can go down. Your LDL cholesterol is likely to go up. Any time you do something that increases your LDL cholesterol, it's worth paying attention to. Especially if it goes up greater than 100 milligrams per deciliter, you are putting yourself at risk for a future cardiac event. If you eat a ketogenic diet and your LDL cholesterol does go up, I want you to think about it and I want you to try and determine whether or not all the other advantages are actually beneficial or whether the increase in LDL cholesterol is warning enough to get you to not eat a ketogenic diet. Even if you can lose weight, even if your blood pressure comes down, even if your A1C comes down, but your LDL cholesterol is going up, stop, think, and do something different.